Now I know what you meant about the sources being more concentrated. I feel different. Many things are different here, the Castiles. You'll discover that in time. Atlantis awaits you. I have one rule that is absolute. Our technology cannot be used on my human civilians. Their bodies cannot withstand the power. The Isu know this above all. So, I'm free to go? What task should the Dicastis do first? Even Atlantis is not a perfect society. It yearns for balance. So be that balance. Then when your role as guide to the people is fulfilled, it may well be perfection. Don't worry. You've already earned my respect, which is a trial in itself. Dicastis, His Eminence Atlas humbly requests that you join him at his doma to discuss a matter of grave importance. Right. I'll make sure to stop by. His Eminence? This place has more kings than Sparta. <laughs> You've arrived! I'm honored that the Castis would accept my humble request. Ah. Your Atlas, I take it. In the flesh. I thank you for coming to see me. I'm sure you're very busy. The burden my father gave you is not a light one. Your messenger told me it was urgent. Gravely urgent, indeed. Well, here I am. It's my brothers, the Archons. They have issues with the human populations under their control. Tensions between Isu and humans are mounting. Without order, the problems will grow severe. I'll try and use my position to help them where I can. Find Hadiros, Amphiris, and Azeas. Through your shining example, I hope they learn the valuable lessons in discipline they so desperately need. And if I help them, you're hoping it'll maintain the peace between Isu and humans. That's the plan. Poseidon should have known they weren't ready for the responsibility an Archon bears. But that's his failing. Tell me about Gaviros. You'll find him near the arena, hard at work planning his next exhilarating spectacle, I'm sure. What should I know about Amphiris? He's probably off terrorizing people near the fortified Doma of Ochtonos. Make sure you don't sneak up on him. He's quite jumpy. What about Azais? Who is he? You'll find dear Azais wherever there is humanitarian work to be done. I heard there were some issues near the Doma of Amphiris. We have Archons where I'm from. Do they fulfill the same duties? They are charged with overseeing and ruling the humans of Atlantis. Ensuring all live comfortably and peacefully, a job at which I fear they're failing. There always seems to be unrest between the two races. The Underworld and Elysium were no different. Time passes and tensions keep building. I expected my father to handle it. But Atlantis grows steadily worse, and no one wants to see what could happen if precautions are not taken. I'll find the Archons, and make sure their problems are taken care of. <clears throat>
Ikea seems like a strange place to find an Archon. Stars, I was beginning to lose all hope. Atlas said you needed help. You don't understand the responsibility on my shoulders. It's my job to concoct entertainment for the masses, but I fear the crowd have grown bored of my grand spectacles. I've seen some good plays and some bad ones. We need more than a simple play. If the audience leave my shows bored and restless, who knows what they'll start plotting? You think they'll become violent? My purpose is to keep them preoccupied so they can't be violent. If your shows have become boring, you just need to get more creative. Oh, the humans are primitive. Their taste's basic. They like life's simpler joys. Blood, tragedy, romance, that sort of thing. So give the people what they want. What they want. Yes, I can hear the cheers now! The legendary Dicastis Cassandra takes on Atlantis' finest warriors! You must take part in my next event! Sounds like a Pangration. I can definitely help with that. Not exactly. But I was inspired by your efforts in Elise. I know you'll do an exemplary job entertaining the crowds as you did then. If we pull this off, We'll be the talk of the city! It's worth a try. Welcome all! Welcome all to yet another miraculous show here in our beloved city! Tonight we have a very special guest! The of Atlantis is here to entertain you! the power of the Atlantean God? Let's find out! All right, Cassandra. Me. That's what he said. Our valiant hero's next challenge fast approaches. A champion bested by none in the city. No mercy, no guilt. Will this be too much for even the Dicastis to overcome?
Champion has been bested! Our mighty Dicastis is victorious and the crowd have spoken! But will she show mercy or will she spill the blood we want? If you don't appease the crowd, I fear what Gaidiros will do. 
It was an honor to fight you, Dicastis. You fought honorably. A fitting end to a glorious life spent this service to you, the audience. Now, on to the grand finale. And here we are. The end of today's event. Next to face our Dicastis' judgment, the very scum that taints our city. By the gods, what is this? For the good of Atlantis, today bear witness to the guilty and condemned given one final chance at redemption. They will be honored to die at the hands of our guest. Enough! I am not doing this! Mm. Uh, fear not, friends! We will make sure justice is delivered. Well, that was an unmitigated disaster. You said fight, so I fought. The problem is that I didn't say fight. I said be as entertaining as possible. This won't help the relations between your people. The humans will see what's going on eventually. The games have failed. The humans are restless, and it's only a matter of time before they make their own entertainment. Their hunger for violence is insatiable. You just need to keep surprising them. Think like a human, not an issue. That's what I tried to do. But you showed the criminals mercy, and the crowd reacted as I expected. Killing people who can't defend themselves isn't entertainment, it's slaughter. Their sacrifice helps us keep the peace and maintain order. Or it would have if you played along. What are you saying, Radiros? That my grand experiment has failed. There's nothing left to be done but start again and try for better results. The arena must be cleared. This is madness. <laughs> Stay hidden if I don't want to fight. I, I'll look into it. Nothing. I worry too much. What?
what was in that box? My body's tingling like mad. Must be more of these somewhere. Metal is heavy. And here's a note. A forge of Atlantis. This can be used to create weapons. I have to find this place. Is Azais a physician and an Archon? It hurts so much, it won't go away. I know, I know. But don't worry. As what have I missed? What must I do? Azais? You have your hands full. Vikastis, 
You're a welcome sight. The only one I've had in some time. So many sick. I'm surprised anything can spread in a place as advanced as this. Oh, it's shocking. Nothing I have tried will cure the sick or stop the pathogen spreading. I've lost so many already. When did you first notice people were getting sick? At the start of this cycle. It began quite slowly and I didn't think much of it. But then the cases grew rapidly day by day. The more that fell sick, the faster the pathogen spread. You seem really worried. Have you ever seen a sickness like this before? No. There are many odd phenomena during this cycle. Plant dying, strange insects and animal attacks. I worry about what this could signify. When did you first notice people were getting sick? At the start of this cycle. Don't worry. We'll find a way to stop the sickness. Tell me what you need. Well, there was a device being worked on by a scientist named Consus. Its intention was to rapidly heal injuries and eradicate disease. Was? His device is missing. Scientists here have tried to replicate it based on the schematics, but it's still in the experimental phase. And it hasn't been tested on humans. So it may not work. That's not the biggest issue. Poseidon has outlawed the use of our technology on humans. I fear that if we don't act quickly, the pathogen will spread across Atlantis. If you think this healing device can help the sick, then I'll make sure that you have it. The wisdom of an issue, but the compassion of a human. You were a good choice for the Gustis. You'll find the device in one of the issue laboratories, in the Consus Archive. The device's ace ones must be inside. Just a bird, but I'll check.
device. It's like nothing I've ever seen.
I've brought the uh, glowing cloth you've asked for. It's a nanotech matter regenerator, in fact. But you have it. I can't believe it. Now then, let's see what this thing can do. Asais, what the fuck did you do? I thought I had calibrated correctly. Oh no, what have I done? I killed this poor human. The device doesn't work and you stole it against Poseidon's laws. What do we do now? The device is dangerous. Maybe Poseidon outlawed it for a reason. I don't think you should use it on anyone else. I was so hopeful, but you're right. This device isn't ready to be used on live subjects. All I've done is add to the pain and suffering. Some things can't be fixed with devices or intellect. There are problems even the Isu can't solve. I suppose all I can do is return this device to the laboratory. ...and make sure the victims are comfortable till the end. Just one more Archon to go. Maybe I should just do their jobs too. 